next out of Shalito come April 3rd at Twin River Casino. You know, what you can expect out of me is I'm coming forward, I'm throwing millions of punches, and um, I'm coming in, I'm throwing hard shots, and I'm, uh, I'm trying to trying to keep it busy, I'm coming forward, and, and I'm, I'm going to try to run through her. You're 13, 13 and 0. Yep. She's coming in 7 and 7. I mean, well, what does that mean to you in regards to numbers? I mean, in women's boxing, you can't really look at the, the records. I mean, take, for example, Jackie Trevolino. She's tough. She goes into a lot of the girls' backyards, and they get robbed a lot. Um, but the losses that Christina has is all the top-notch um, uh, opponents in, like, title fights, like Kalisha West. I think Jennifer Hahn. She, she had a bunch of them. Uh, so, you know, she, she's tough. She's coming forward. I mean, I, I, know, she, I know she's strong, and, and her record, she, she's way better than her record. I know that. I'm, I'm expecting another war, and I, 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 know, I know I'm in a tough one. I mean, I feel good. It's um, I'm defending the UBF title that I hold, and we're fighting for the um, IBA. So, you know, I mean, it, it just it makes me want to train harder and work harder, and you know, it's a, it just it just made everything bigger. And I think it's good for women's boxing. I mean, and it's perfect. The name of the show to revive when we're trying to revive our sport. And I, th I think this is a great fight for the sport. Just as my last. Excellent. Now, the last time I seen you about maybe a month ago, you know, you you, you looked in great shape. But now that I see you a month later, you look in excellent shape. I mean, in 30 days, 30 days. I mean, it's like you transformed yourself. I mean, your face looks thinner. Uh, 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 your, your body looks like it's, it's ripped. Yep. I mean, what 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 have you done in 30 days to get yourself at the physical conditioning level you are right now? I mean, that, that was, I, I, I was on vacation and I came back and, um, you know, I was just getting back in. They, they told me I was going to have the fight. So I, I just I just started training and taking my diet serious and, and eating properly. And then I also started doing my strength conditioning and Pete started working me hard. So, you know, it just, it comes right off. I'm, I don't stay too far away from the weight, you know, so it melted right off. And um, we just got busy, that's all. And, and I took the diet a little bit serious. The majority of the time when female boxers, you know, prepare themselves for a fight and they, and they spend time in the gym sparring, they spar other females, you know, other women. But you, it's a different story with you. I've seen you in the ring sparring against men. Yeah. Men that are bigger than you. Yeah. I mean, tell us about that. I mean, if, if there's girls around, then we, then we get in there with the girls, but I prefer to go with the guys, because I feel like once you get in there with the girls, it kind of makes the fight easier. And, you know, I, I'm getting in there with the bigger guys. Just, you know, whoever we can get in there with, and the guys, you know, they, they, they really push me, and it's a little bit different. So I think it gives me the edge when it comes around fight time. And I, I love that the guys get in there and still bang it up and trade with me. So. Excellent. So CES Boxing and Jimmy Birchfield Sr. has... Uh put you on the headline of this event taking place April 3rd. Um, it's a championship bout. You know, it's a great opportunity. Um, what what can you tell us in regards to the name, The Revival? Why is it being called The Revival? Um, I think for, for, for me and, um, you know, for, for Jimmy, I, I, first of all, I like to thank Jimmy and CES, Mike and everybody for supporting women's boxing the way they do, especially me. You know, um, Jimmy's been, Jimmy's, I've been with Jimmy since day one, and he gave me a shot, and he gave me a chance, and I proved that, you know, girls can do it. I'm, I'm selling the place out. I'm putting butts in the seat. And if it wasn't for Jimmy, I wouldn't even have that opportunity to do that. So thank you, Jimmy and CES. And, I'm, you know, it's the revival because we're trying to revive it and bring it back. You know, like Christy Martin had it big. Layla Ali had it big. And they're, they're letting me headline. This is my, this is my third headline. And um, two back-to-back. -back. This is my second sellout show back-to-back. -back. And, um... Just like we, we, we trying to revive the sport and make it a little bit bigger for the kids and everything, you know, so that's that's what it means to me. Excellent. So, Shelly, you know, we appreciate the time. We appreciate the opportunity to be able to interview you one more time. We look forward to seeing you getting into the ring against Christina Ruiz, April 3rd at Twin River Casino with CES Boxing. We wish you the best. We wish you a whole lot of luck. And um, we truly believe that you're going to step into the ring and you're going to do what you do best. You're going to shine. So, uh, God bless. Take care. Thank you guys very much for having me. I want to thank Super Elite Boxing for giving me the time. Striking Beauties, Manfredo's Gym, and Havoc Boxing. Thank you guys for always believing with me and uh, seeing me along the way through my journey. Thank you.